Hi. Hi, Dennis. Hey, hi, teacher. How are you? I'm doing great. How are you? Good, good. Not bad. Hello. How are you? Luis, are you there? Yes, yeah. I'm. Okay. Yes, I'm here. Okay, good, good. Sorry, sorry. All right, not a problem. How are you guys? I'm fine, fine. Good, good. I, I thought uh, today the, the recent class <laughs> because uh, I saw the news. Yeah. Well, to be honest, I'll, I'll be honest. Uh, yesterday, when I when uh, I saw the news, I thought also that it wasn't going to happen. Uh, but then I remembered that uh, the thing is that in support, sometimes those things don't really apply to in support because they are not um, they are not a like a school really, you know. So it's a totally different thing. It's it's so it doesn't really like those kind of things do not apply. So um, we go basically with what in support tells us. And so we have to sometimes wait for the guidelines and in support is the one that decides if there's gonna be classes or they're gonna be some suspending them. But usually almost all the time, like, I mean, it's very difficult for in support to, to suspend classes only if it's like, something really major but yeah it's basically their call they decide if they're going to suspend the classes or not so it's really not us like we you know we just follow their instructions right like as english corporativo we just say okay you say there are classes there are classes <laughs> right so yeah <laughs> that's it yeah so in a way it's good because i mean at least we get a chance there to um continue practicing and everything so that's something that's um uh, that's positive right um so anyways guys tell me how was your weekend or long weekend yes long weekend it was very nice Woo! <laughs> did you guys have fun this long weekend yes i thought it was a uh, uh, a uh, weekend in house, maybe all weekend. Sorry, you thought it was a what weekend? Sorry? Sorry, what did you say? You thought it was a what weekend? Um, I don't know, I have a problem with connection, maybe. I can hear it well. You can't hear me in this moment? Can you hear me guys right now or no? Maybe like, it's me. Not, Maybe not I really. Have... Maybe it's with uh, some trouble with your connection, teacher. Oh, okay. I thought it was me, my connection, but maybe it's the teacher. Okay, connection. can you can you guys hear me right now or no? It's like the statistics or the electronic voice. Oh, okay. It's like robotic. Yeah. Oh. What about right now? Can you still, can you hear me better? Oh, it's better now. Yes, better okay. now. Okay, all right. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes, uh, you know, with the connection, it's, uh, you never know. Okay, all right, guys. Uh, so what did you guys do on the, on the long weekend? Tell me about it. My long weekend, I only, Went out to the mall um, Saturday. Okay. And Sunday, I was playing with my band at oh. night. Nice. Okay, so you have Only a band? That. This, yeah, I have a band. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, what what a were you a playing? metal band. It's one Sorry? metal? It's metal, heavy metal. 
Oh, heavy metal. Oh, yeah. how interesting. Okay, all right. Um, okay. And this is this is my my long weekend. Ah. Only that. And what do you do? You play in the band, or are you the singer of the band, or what do you do in the band? I'm drummer. You're the drummer. Oh, yes. Okay. You're the drummer. Interesting. Wow. Okay. Interesting. And do you guys play like at, at concerts or things like that? Or do you just play for fun? Uh, actually, <laughs> only for us because uh, there, there, there aren't a concert. Oh, okay. Really. Okay. It's just, so it's just more of like for fun. That kind of right thing. now, right now, yes, we yeah. only practice new song, only that. Oh, okay, good. good um, good. this is it, it was it was my Sunday. Uh, Saturday, I only went out with my wife at mall at at an afternoon, only that. Oh, okay, okay. Do you only have any that. children? No, yet. Oh, oh, okay. Not yet. So you that means that yet. they are in the plans. They're in the in, in, the, in the future, maybe, maybe, maybe. This okay. is this is the plan in the future. Nice. One, okay. one, one children, maybe. One child. Only one child? One child. One child. Okay. Okay. Well that'd be nice. That's good. Okay. Excellent. All right. Well, um, so I see we have some people. I don't know what happened to the others. Maybe they thought that we didn't have class. I don't know. I don't know uh, because, yeah, but I think it was clear, right? I think every, it was clear that we were going to be having class today. But anyways, guys, um, I'm sorry. By the way, I apologize for Thursday. Uh, on Thursday was a very weird day, uh, or better said night, because, you know, it wasn't raining. Um, you know, it was, it was just very, it was, it was a clear day. And then all of a sudden, boop, the lights went off and it lasted for like more than 30 minutes. I don't know why, it, you know, it never happens. It never happens in my neighborhood. Uh, like it will, maybe the most that it lasts for are like five minutes. But then on Thursday, it was like 30 minutes. So I'm so sorry, guys, for that. I really apologize. Um, Don't worry. Yeah. So anyways, uh, but I hope you guys were able to do what I asked you guys to do for homework. Uh, if you guys remember, I asked you to make a timeline of um, some activities. If I'm not mistaken, let's see if I, if I... Yeah, 10 events. I asked for 10 events um, in your in the timeline, right? Did you guys do the, the timeline? Everybody has their timeline? Not really, teacher. Okay. Um, well, if you don't have it, let's do it right now. Like very, very quickly. Like uh, just jot down some things while you are jotting down some things in case you haven't done it. I'll just quickly remind you what we're going to be doing. On Thursday, we saw um, that when we have a timeline here, so imagining that this is the present. Okay, so everything over here, whatever. So um, I said, I, what I was, uh, we're talking about uh, on Thursday's class is that in real life, we don't have just two events of the past. In real life, we have many events um, that are happening in the past. Um, for example, we can have an event over here. Then we can have another event 
over here. Okay, then we can have another event over here. Then we can have another event uh, maybe over here. Okay. And maybe there's some time in between where we have no events and that, then there's another one over here. And maybe we have another one over here. Okay. And then maybe we have another event over here. And then maybe we have another one over here. And then, um, let's see, we have another event over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine more. Okay, and then finally we have another event. Um, let's see, I'm going to choose. This cover. Then we have another event over here. Okay, so the so let's just say let's uh, like obviously in our lives we have more than one event. Okay, um, but let's imagine that um, that this is our timeline when when we have in this event we have. I better said in this timeline we have ten events like I asked you to do for homework. Um, just give me a second. So we have number one, number two. So this is in a chronological order, okay? Okay, so we have here the 10 events. And when we are describing these events, what we want to do is say, which one happened before the other one, okay? So let's say that I am describing this event over here. Okay, I'm describing this event and I'm also describing this event. So we're describing event number two and an event number five. So then I'm going to be, um, I'm going to say, that this event happened before this one. I'm gonna say, for example, to give you an example, um, I, I had, I had uh, already accepted um, my current job before I graduated. So maybe here I get the job and here I graduate. So I say I had accepted my job by the time I graduated. Okay, well, or so the so what I'm doing is I'm contrasting these two and I'm saying that this one happened before this one. Okay, so to give you a little bit more clarification here, I'm going to write it down. So this action of Let's say get job. This section of getting the job happens before the graduation. Graduate. Okay. So I say I had gotten the job before I graduated. So this would be in the simple past, and this one would be in the in the past perfect because this one is the first action chronological speaking. And this is the second action, chronologically speaking. Does that make sense, guys? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So that's how you're going to be. Um, that's how you're going to be talking about it when you are describing the action, right? So you're going to be saying, for example, <clears throat> I had blah blah blah. Um. Maybe 
by the time I blah, 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 blah. All right, this, this is just an example because this can vary, right? I could say, instead of saying I, it could be we, we had, right? Or we can say when, okay, so I had gotten a job when I graduated. So this doesn't necessarily have to be by the time. I can say when or whatever. So that, this is just giving you an example, okay? Now, what you're gonna do though, is because you're work, gonna be working in pairs uh, with a partner, you're going to be asking your partner questions, okay? And how do you, we learned on Thursday how to ask questions, right? So we ask questions using, starting with had, for example, had you, by the time you, and again, this is just an example, right? There are many other ways that you could ask this, but the important thing is that you're always gonna be using had, had you, okay? Had he, had she, et cetera, et cetera. That's what's important. Had you, for example, you could say, had you gotten a job by the time you graduated? And then the answer would be, yes, I had, or no, I hadn't, okay? That would be the answer, okay? So there are two possibilities that you can write down here. Yes, I had, or no, I hadn't. Got it? Okay, that's it. Yeah. Okay, so that's what we're going to be doing right now. This is um, going to be the activity that we're going to do in the next few minutes. I'm going to be assigning you in pairs. Uh, there are eight of you, which is perfect because that means that we can work all with a partner. Okay, so take a picture of this if you need it. Remember, this is only an example. You can use other words, like, for example, the subject can change. Uh, what's important here is that we're using like had, for example. Um, so it's important to use the had. I had, you had, he had, or it could also, I'm gonna actually make this a little bit. Um, It could also be had it. So you can say, um, so it could also be negative, right? Um, so maybe we can say, I hadn't graduated when I got a job. I hadn't graduated when I got the job. So it can also be that, right? So it can be affirmative or it could be negative, okay? The important thing is that you use had or hadn't. Okay. And over here, what's important is that you start the, the that you start the, um, uh, the question with had. That's always, we're always gonna have use had. And over here, you gotta make sure you use the past participle. Okay, don't forget the past participle. I'm gonna write it down just in case so that you guys don't forget. I'm just gonna write here PP. Um, Past participle, that's what it's gonna stand for. Okay, PP. Um, it's because I don't wanna erase so much. It's, uh, it's gonna get crowded if I write too much. Okay, so over here, just make sure you put the, the past, past participle. Okay, so had you, for example, had you graduated by the time you got a job? or had you gotten a job by the time you graduated, okay?
All right, guys, any questions? Just make sure no. you, you write, um, just make sure that you, sorry, uh, that you make questions, right? All right, okay, so I'm going to put you guys into your groups. Um, okay, let's see. Okay, so random order, you can start now. Go ahead and join your groups. Uh, do you guys have any problems? Are you having any problems right now joining? Josue, do you have any problems joining? Josue, Claudia, are you having any problems? Something I can help you with? Claudia, Josue, do you have any problems? Hi, teacher. Hi. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, I think it's okay. Everything is okay? And uh, for me, yes. Uh, okay. All right. But can you can you join your group? Because I I, I was I sent you supposedly to a group. And you haven't joined. You're in group number 4. Okay, there we go. Hi, Dennis. Hey, hi. Um, I noticed that you are alone. Yes. Um, so I'm going to send you right now one person to come and join you. Okay. There he is. All right. Hi, Alex. Can you hear us? Hi, teacher. Good evening. I'm sorry. I just have to to join to the to the room. Okay. Okay. Uh, do we? Do you understand what we're doing? Uh, no, I don't know. I haven't uh, listened the indication. Uh, okay. So basically, do you remember that on Thursday I asked you for homework to make a, a timeline with ac actions or. Um, activities that had happened to you in your life? Oh, uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so what you're going to be doing is you're going to be talking about your timeline, about your life, 
with the dentist. You're gonna tell him what happened before, what happened after. So you're gonna say, for example, I had gotten a job when I graduated from college, okay? So you're going to be talking about the, the past perfect form uh, of the first chronological action of the two actions that you're gonna be describing. Does okay, that, teacher, it's right. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay, all right. So go ahead and work with Dennis um, and ask questions too, using the past perfect, okay? Okay. All right. Okay, so pretend I'm not here, you guys start talking. All right, Alex. Hi, Dennis. So tell me about your, your experience. Go ahead, tell me. <laughs> or oh, let's ask if you want. Had you, what? Have you, had you dropped a trap, for example? Excuse me, I didn't understand. Had you drop, driven a truck? What's the past participle of drive? Drive, drive, drive in? Drive. Actually, driven. The, the, yes, it's correct, but just the pronunciation is not driving, it's driven. Driven, Ara. Driven. Yes. Yeah. Had you driven a truck? Driven, driven. Driven. Uh, well, I haven't. I haven't driven a truck. I just haven't draw, uh, driven uh, cars, tipo uh, sedan. I don't know how to say, or just uh, little cars. Around. Yeah, and also motorcycles. Have you ever? No, I hadn't driven a motorcycle yet. Uh, or by yeah. the time mm -hmm. it's a kind of of dangerous but it's very exciting it's very exciting and it's and it is and uh difficult to drive in. okay but i had uh driving driven um a bicycle that is kind of it's similar situation same. i i got it it's better, right? Yes. Are you in peace with, with that? I have to finish some points. But actually, I, I, I'm finished tomorrow. Yeah. I think so. Do you have any question? Do you have, had you, had you warming while you studying at university? Everything is okay. And you? Uh, yeah, me too. I had it. So continue the conversation, guys. Uh, okay. Okay, teacher. <laughs> Thanks. Have you worked meanwhile your your partner stay in vacation? Just instead of saying meanwhile, just say me uh, just say while. While. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you repeat that? Okay, please. Okay. Um, let me remind. Had you uh, had you working, meant your uh, sorry while your partner 
stayed in vacation. Okay, just just a little bit, uh, just a quick observation. Uh, remember, you use the past participle and not, so it wouldn't be working. You wouldn't say had you working. Uh, it would be had you. Had, had you? Uh -huh. What's the past participle of work? Work. Worked, teacher, I think. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, you're right, Josue. It's worked. Mm -hmm. Okay. Worked. Okay, worked. Mm -hmm. And I, I repeat, had you worked uh, while your partner stayed in vacation? Ah, Becca. Um, uh, American school. American school, ah. Uh-huh, yeah. Like a professor, no? Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, really? Me too. Me too. I, I have been studying English at that at that American school too. Yeah. With uh with the professor Becca. The professor. That is a. And yes, I have been studying English in 2013 and 2013 and 2014. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 14, yeah. Two years. I have. Maybe it's a uh, four months. Maybe I, I don't remember because the problem, my problem was uh, the job because ah, that's yeah. very complicated because I had to work to all night. And the problem is uh, the, the schedule. I remember it, from it, it's I, I, very complicated. Yes. I remember for me it was difficult too, because I I had to up of my work at at six at uh, a quarter to six because the class began at six p.m. and yeah and find in, in the, 6 the, p.m. The nine. to, to nine, nine. 9 p.m. Nine. Nine PM. So hard. Yeah. Three hours per day. All right, guys. I don't want to interrupt. Yeah, but that. To okay. Learn. Sorry. Hello, I, teacher. I don't, don't want to interrupt you. But I just wanted to mention, be careful. I need you guys to be using this, the past part, uh, the past perfect. So I, I'm hearing a lot of simple past, but I don't hear very much past perfect. Okay, remember, past perfect, you make it using had, then past participle. And, 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 and better, and better, and part, part. Okay, sorry? Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay we, are trying, we are trying to use, teacher. Yeah, yeah. Okay, go ahead, continue. <laughs> and I'm not here. Okay, thank, thank you, thank you. Okay. And what happened in, in, in that time, someone? I have been to um, to work to some some time. I, I have to. I have been to work to uh, so early in morning because I I have to I have a problem because I have to. You have to gotten a, a new job. You have gotten a new job. No, uh, no, no, I have to that's... speak to my boss and he changed my my schedule. And your, your schedule, huh? Uh, yeah, I have to start in in, in Alguara. He has seven. changed. He has changed. Yeah, changed seven, your, seven your schedule. And yeah. Is when I work at seven i put the the audio and the subtitles in english be, yeah. because mm -hmm. that is the way to improve the in the english 
Yes, I imagine. Yeah. Hey, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hi, guys. How are you? Yes, trying to good, try. good. <laughs> just listening here. Just pretend that I'm not here. Okay. okay. <laughs> Ignore me. <laughs> okay. But it's a little difficult. All right. Just, just pretend bit. you you are not here. Yes, yes. No. <laughs> you know, put a, something on top of the cover that you know, so you don't see the name. And just mm -hmm. call me. <laughs> okay. okay. Teacher, um, today I finished uh, the whole uh, course. Hey, good for you, Raphael. Excellent. Thanks. And um, there is any other thing that I got to do there? Uh, did you do the final exam? Yes. Oh, perfect. And did you get at least 80% or above? They, they even uh, gave me the certificate. Oh, OK. There you go. Then no, no, that's it. That's you, you finished. Oh, OK. Nothing okay. more, Raphael. Yeah. Just, just to practice. Continue practice. And if you want, what you can do is go back and and um, and uh, practice you review? practicing uh, the, the sentences that you had problems with. You can go ahead and, and practice more. Or like the discussion boards, you can go and do uh, more exercises on discussion board. But the, the only thing is that your grade is not going to change, right? OK. Uh, so whatever you've got in the certificate, that's what you get, right? But um, but but you can still practice. That's the important part. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Yeah. Good for you. Good for you, Rafael. Sí, okay. congr congrats, Rafael. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, any questions? And as far now, no, teacher. Okay. Okay. Well, continue practice a little bit. I'll I'll call you back in about one or two more minutes. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Perfect. Teacher. Thank right. you. You're welcome. Okay. What about okay. is we talk about um, spooky stories in the past? <laughs> what? Sorry, what? What if? What about if we talk about spooky stories? What is mean spooky? Like a scary story. How I had to. I need a. a, a... Okay, that's good. Uh, a lot of people. Uh, a lot of people. Uh, uh, yeah, yes. That's good. Somewhere. Pain. And the in, in the great feeling is about the you can practice your English with that person. Yes, because, because the, a lot the, of foreign the, person visit 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 that place. Yeah, you need to to yeah about the lose the the pray pray is a you know you can.
Okay. Um, all right, guys. So um, I would like to hear you guys uh, giving some some of your examples. Can you all hear me right now? Yes. Okay, good. All right. So I would like you guys to give me a little bit of your examples of some of the activities in your life that you have been able to accomplish. And you're going to tell us which one happened before the other one. So volunteers here who would like to share with the class their, their timeline. Only one, guys. Only one person. No, not everybody. <laughs> okay, just one. Only one person. I just need one. Oh. Oh. Um. Can I say one? Okay. Yeah. Go ahead, Raphael. Yeah. Great. Um. My family had already gone to the beach, but the moment when I got to when I got home. Could you repeat that again, Rafael? Okay. Um, my family had already gone to the beach by the moment when I got, oh uh, yeah, by the moment when I got home. Okay, okay, good. All right, just be careful. It wouldn't be by the moment, it would be by the time. By the time okay. I got home. Mm -hmm. That's good, excellent. Very, very good. Okay, excellent. Who's who's next? Rafael, you can choose. You can choose a victim. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, um Luis. Luis um, Mesa, I think. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Rafael. <laughs> <laughs> you will be the big <laughs> Okay, let's go. Uh, I had played soccer at night while my family uh, came back. Sorry, could you try that again? Um, I had played soccer. At night. Uh -huh. uh, when my family came back. Came back from like, came back home? Okay, came back home. Okay, all right, yeah, okay, good. Uh, excellent, all right, good. Go ahead and choose your next victim. I choose the other Luis. Okay, go it's ahead. Enrique. Thank you, Luis Mesa. <laughs> <laughs> you are do, do you guys so bad. Know? You are so bad, man. <laughs> you, know, you guys, uh, in Spanish, we say tocayo, tocayo, right? Tocayo, yes. Uh -huh. yes and do you know how to say that in English? Ah, no, teacher. How no, do I, no, I don't know. Okay. So you're going to be choosing your namesake. Your name. Name. Sick. Yeah. Your name. Uh, okay. So Luis. Okay. Could you write it in the chat, please? Could you write it? Sure. I'll write it in the chat. I think it'll be easier if I write in the chat. Okay. Teacher. Yeah. So I cannot say by the moment when you get there. It's incorrect. I gotta say, no. by the time you by get the there. Time. By the time. Okay. Names. Names. How do you pronounce? How do you pronounce name? Sake. Sake. Name. Sake. Like okay. sick. <laughs> okay. Back to name sick. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Right. So go ahead. Go ahead. Here, here we go. My example. Okay. 
I was working on my business, my own business report while my sums um, have, have got an accident in a, in a car crash. Could you repeat that again? I was working on my own business report while my sums had gotten a car, car was on a car crash. Okay. Car crash. Yeah, okay. The only the only problem I guess that I see with that one is that that action is not finished. The working on the project is a continuous action. It's not finished. Uh, when uh, when your, oh, car, okay. your children get in a car, in a car crash, My, it's not finished yet. Does mm -hmm. that make sense? Yes, it makes sense. Okay, so you got to make sure that you are using something um, that is talking about an activity that is finished, that is complete before the other okay. action. I, so I, what, what happened I can before say, I, I can. Mm -hmm. I can say then I have I I I already I, I have already finished my own business report while my my sons have have gotten a gotten got a, a car crash. Okay, yes, but not without the while because while is mientras. It means that it's a long action. Oh, okay. So it'd be oh, yeah, I have yeah, finished yeah. my my report, my business report. My own business then report. My 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 children were in a car accident. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. That would okay. be okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Okay, all right, good, excellent guys. All right, before we continue guys, I want to just um, do a quick, a quick, um, um, I'm going to make a quick poll because I want to know um, how you guys are doing in the um, okay just a question can you guys see right now uh, there is a poll can you guys see the poll right now? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Sorry? Not yet, teacher. Not yet. Okay. Just a second. Second, guys, he doesn't want to cooperate with me. Okay, you should be able to see it now. Yes, okay. All right, so just uh, take the quick poll. I just want to know there how you guys are doing. We're going to mark a. You just mark the one that you're that you're working on right now. Which section you are working on? Oh, okay. Okay. I just want to know. If, be honest. I'm not. You know, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Um, you know, scold or anything. I just want to know approximately how you guys are doing. So I still have some people that haven't voted yet. But for example, I have finished almost that platform. Okay, but, but if, if you're not finished, then 
then like what are you doing are you doing section four or five the final yeah. exam oh, part? Okay. Oh, oh, okay 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 so I, 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 have, I have i have something exercise uh in one section for example okay all right there are two people that haven't voted yet i don't but know if it's I because have, you can't I, see yet i yeah so I still have two people who haven't voted. So I just want to know approximately where you guys are standing. So don't worry, like I'm 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 not I'm not gonna use this uh you know for anything in particular. I just want to know approximately how much I need to help you guys with. Okay. So one more person, I don't know who it is, I really don't know who it is. You can just vote there which section you are on, whatever section it is, even if it's section one. I just hope that it, you are, you have started, <laughs> that you're not like on like section zero. <laughs> okay, all right, good, good, good. Okay, well, I, I think maybe they're, they're having trouble, they're voting. But anyways, I have the majority of you. Okay, so it looks like the majority of you are somewhere around section five and the final exam and three of you have already finished that's very good excellent uh congratulations to the people that finished the platform it's wonderful good for you okay so that gives me an idea how you are doing um if you are uh like if you are in section four that's still okay um but if you're in section three you might start working a little bit faster because remember we only have this week. Uh, we have until Friday and that's it. So basically we have tonight, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. We have uh, four day, three days and one night to finish, that's it. Okay, so it's not very much. So I need you guys to work a little bit harder. Now, if you guys are having a problem with something, I need you to um, send me a message directly. Uh, probably the best thing would be to uh, to ask me directly on the WhatsApp group so I can help you with the with the exercise. I'm not going to give you the answer. I'm not going to say, write this, but I'm going to help you to identify what's the problem, okay? Okay, guys, so that okay. will be all. Uh, okay. yeah. Any questions that you guys have? Teacher? Yeah. Um, do you teach in any other uh, English course? Here in Sephor, do you have any other group? I do have another group. Yes, yes. Why? Okay. Um. What about if we if we want to change of of the group? I I was trying to. Well, in fact, I'm going to enroll in the next course, right? Okay. So I would like to try to enroll in another different to pre advanced number two. Can I do that? You want to go to another course that is not uh, pre advanced two? Pre advanced two, yes. I you want like to go to higher or lower or what? Um, higher? You want to I go like higher. To higher? Okay. Um, let me find out for you what can be done. Okay. okay. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. I can't guarantee okay. that you will be able to go a higher. Uh, but I will find out for you if there is that possibility. Okay, Rafael? Okay. Sounds good? So I'll, I'll find yeah. out for you and I'll let yeah. you know as soon as I can. Okay? Okay, thanks. All right, you're welcome. All right, any other questions that you guys have? No, no, that's good. no, no. thank you. No? Okay, all right. Um, so like I said, oh, um, actually I had somebody ask me a question. Uh, I'm just gonna use these last few minutes there to fix the answer or something. I did have somebody ask me a question about the passive. Oh, no, 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 never mind. Never mind. I just remember something. No, forget it, forget it. Okay, forget it. I, no, I got confused here. Okay, um, so you guys, like I said, um, you should be finishing by Friday. Um, is there anybody that feels that you, you're gonna have trouble finishing uh, for this week?
No? Okay. And the other thing I'm going to make what, sure what is... is... Yes or no? What is... Uh, I can hear you well. You can't hear me well? What did you... Yeah, yeah. I don't understand what you say. Okay, no. What? I, okay. What I was asking is, is there anybody in this class who feels that you cannot finish the platform this week? That it will be impossible to finish the platform this week on Friday? No, I, 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 I only I have to to finish that one section because I I finished the exam, the the old exercise, but I only one section because I have a a problem. So maybe I a period or something when I write the the the, the answer, but that is only okay. The, the other is. But I, I will try to, to change the words and something. Okay. Okay, good. Good, good. good. Um, yeah. And remember, uh, the platform is open uh, at any time. You can work at any moment. Uh, it, you know, if, if you are, you know, up in the middle of the night and you want to do something, I don't know. I don't re recommend, you know, um, you know, doing it if you, if, uh, you know, just because I'm going to finish it. But. Uh, but if you if you're up a little bit late and you want to uh, work on it, go ahead. It's open at any time of the night, um, 24 hours a day. And the other thing is that you can continue practicing. So just because you do an exercise and you got it wrong doesn't mean that that's the only grade that you're going to get. The more you practice it, the better you will get at it. The greater the grade. Remember, you have to have a minimum of 80 percent to be able to pass. And remember that this course is based mostly on the platform, right? So it's part of it is the class, but most of it is the platform. So you need to have a minimum of 80%. If you don't have 80%, you will not be able to go to the next, um, the next level. And there is the tentative, tentative, let me, let me clarify, the tentative um, date to begin the next course will be on the 11th okay so on the 11th of the month the, uh, that's a tentative um time to start again the next level okay so that would okay. that's supposed to be if i'm not mistaken that's a wednesday okay so that would be next wednesday okay any questions in fact, today, I think it was the, the deadline to send the, the document. Yes, right? exactly. You're right. You're absolutely right. Any Anybody had problems sending the documents? No, not really. No? Okay. And remember, sending the documents doesn't necessarily mean that you're automatically going to go to the next level. It, because, like I said, if you didn't finish the platform, you won't be able to go to the next level. You have to finish the platform. That's why it's important that you finish this Friday. Okay? Yeah. Okay. okay. All right, guys. So um, tomorrow we're going to be starting uh, looking at, well, today was kind of like a wrap up of section four. And tomorrow we're going to start with section five. Uh, you, you should be able to finish and start already with section five. There are some things that you don't need, need to explain. It's just like a, listening and stories and things like that but there are other ones that you do need explanation and we're going to start with that tomorrow okay so that will be all for everybody right. it's been great seeing you guys again um yeah we we haven't seen each other for a long time i feel like it's been ages since i've seen you because it was you know a long, long time ago but i'm glad you guys are all well i'm glad you guys haven't had any problems that um in your neighborhood you know with the with the hurricane and hopefully everything stays the same. So take care, guys. Have a wonderful night. See you tomorrow. You too, teacher. Okay. You too, teacher. Thank, Thank you. You're welcome. Good night. Bye. Good night. Thank you. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.